Hello. It's mid-morning here at the busy accident unit of St. Gregory's Teaching Hospital, Slough. And I'm here this morning because I've accidentally stuck my fingers together <laughs> with super glue. <laughs> Dino Capella will die today. In just a few minutes from now, he will go to the chair for committing a series of horrific murders that shocked America. Hi, I'm Bud Clark. <laughs> in a special telecast, we've been allowed to film inside the death cell on the actual day of execution. MBS TV and our sponsors, Honey Yum, the yummy honey flavored weedy cake that gives you a sunshine start to the day, brings you death of a combo. <laughs> One can only guess what is going through Dino's mind at this moment in time. A mind which just minutes from now will be brain dead. And here we see the priest, Father Patrick O'Malley, offering some comfort to this condemned man, Dino Capella. Fortitude, Dino. Cut. Okay, uh, MBS TV, Father. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay, Lou. Yeah, okay. We're having a problem with sound. I wonder if you could just say th something for level. Level? What do you mean? That's great, Father. Yeah, just keep it like that. Okay, keep the energy going and, and just relax. You know, kind of enjoy yourself. Okay, go. quiet, everybody. Quiet. And action. Dino. Oh, Father. Fortitude, my son. Did the priest say fortitude last time? <laughs> Continuity, Father. Uh, he did. He did. Okay, okay, okay. And moving along and in your own time, Father. <laughs> I'm scared, Father. God is with you, my son. <gasps> but I don't want to die. We oh, all have whoa, to whoa, die. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, excuse me, uh, Dino, we're just wondering if you can beef up that line. I don't want to die. But I don't want to die. That's great, Dino. Yeah. We want another one like that. And remember, America's watching. But I don't want to die. And now, Warden Brown is coming into the cell. The man who will be throwing the switch on Dino. Time to go, Dino. His nose is shining. Make up. <laughs> Time to go, Dino. Okay, uh, hold it there. I'm, I'm sorry, but, uh, you know, uh, could you sort of deliver it with a bit more edge? Could you say something like, um, Dino, it's time to go. It's time for you to fry in the electric chair. Not, okay, that's great. Do. That's great. Okay, and quiet, everybody. Yep. Okay, and action. Dino, it's time for you to go. It's time for you to... Uh, is it time for me to fry in the electric chair, Warren? Electric chair, that's it. Okay, son, let's go. Be brave, Dino. Have a nice day. <laughs> My name is Chris. I'm well to do. My name's Steve. I'm well odd. <laughs> My tastes are for the opera, playing polo, and weekending in Paris with my secretary. My tastes are lager. Shafting <laughs> and kicking in edge. I have a penchant for antique furniture. I'll have a pension when I retire. <laughs> My other half's called Sharon. She's a bit of all right. My other half's called Leslie. He's a boxer. <laughs> I hate people who destroy the environment. I hate people. <laughs> My idea of a good time is to step into my luxurious Mercedes car, having eaten a very expensive meal washed down by the finest of wines and a couple of glasses of Remy Martin. Then I drive home to my Surrey mansion at 120 miles an hour. My idea of having a good time is getting in my white three-litre Rover with a flashing blue light on the top and nicking pillocks like you. <laughs> Please, sir, just the 
surprise of a cup of tea. Oh, yes, please, Miss Kavanagh, I've got kids yes, to yes, feed. Yes, yes. Bloody nurses. <laughs> Billy. Hello, Johnny. Hello, Hello everyone. everyone. <laughs> today, we're in the operating theatre. <laughs> and today, we're going to play a game of doctors and nurses. We've got lots of lovely toys. <laughs> and we're going to use these toys when we play with our friend William. Aren't we, William? <laughs> It's time for the anaesthetic now. Anaesthetic? That's a very long word, isn't it? <laughs> we know a song about that, don't we? <laughs> dream, 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 dream. <laughs> there. William's dreaming now. So it's time for Billy to take out his tonsils. Snip, hi-ho, snip, it's off to work we go. <laughs> Billy? Yes, Johnny? I don't think that's where William keeps his tonsils. <laughs> oh, I think I've made a mistake. <laughs> we know a song about that, don't we? <laughs> he had a lovely bunch of coconuts. <laughs> but he hasn't any more. <laughs> Still, it'll take his mind off his... Sore throat. <laughs> We've got to go now. But remember, if you want to keep your coconuts, then don't sleep with my wife like William did. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Are you a businessman? <laughs> Are you a businessman? Yes. I thought you were. I thought you were a businessman. I took one look at you at your attire. I thought that man is a businessman, I thought. <laughs> so you're a businessman then, are you? <laughs> yes. This business you're a businessman in, is it your own business or somebody else's business? Not that it's any of my business, of course. <laughs> it's my own business. What sort of business is this business you were in then? I run an industrial consultants firm. Well, so it's sort of a business business, is it, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Is it a large business or a small business? It's a small business. How often do you have sex with your wife? <laughs> Beg your pardon. This business of yours, is it an interesting business, is it? It's quite interesting. Is it in the city? Is it a city business? Yes. So you're a city businessman then? Yes. How often do you have sex with your wife? <laughs> no, I only want to know how often you have sex with your wife, that's all. Mind your own business. I haven't got a business. You're the one with a business. <laughs> and on the subject of having sex with your wife, how often do you do the business? Right, that's it. I've had enough. You vicar. <laughs> Once a day and twice on Sundays. <laughs> the tortoise. Terrestrial member of the reptilian order Chelonia. The tortoise is protected by a casing of horn covered bone. And they vary in size from just a few inches to several hundred weight. And it has been known for the tortoise to have a lifespan in excess of 200 years. But perhaps the most interesting fact about the tortoise is their insatiable and instinctive desire for bonking. <laughs> Since they crawled out of the oceans all of those millions of years ago, the tortoise has evolved into the most productive and efficient sex machine <laughs> in the animal kingdom. Put a male tortoise next to a female tortoise, 
and within seconds the male will mount the female in the simmering fit of unbridled tortoise passion. <laughs> Yes, before you can almost blink, the two tortoises are at it, hammer and tongs. <laughs> Once the male smells the alluring scent of the female, his sexual organs become aroused and mating is imminent. the male has mounted the female, then turbulent, one might almost say violent copulation takes place. <laughs> Identity is a problem with the tortoise, but uh, once it's established, who should be on top? Well, they bonk away like like two tortoises. <laughs> Copulation can last anything up to whew, 10 seconds. And then an amazing thing happens. And this is the one trait that the tortoise has in common with man. After copulation, he dismounts and flakes out. <laughs> and likes to wind down with a lettuce leaf. <laughs> Which, as a matter of fact, leads us very neatly into this. How was it for you? How was what? <laughs> the whole thing was an absolute scream and we hooted till dawn. And then last week it was even worse. We were dubbing a Yugoslavian film into English. Spanking Slavs, would you believe? For Peter, you remember Peter? The one with the earrings. Yes, that's right. And he turned to me and had the temerity to suggest that somehow the whole thing... Okay, loves. Ugo, Miriam, ready on the red light. All right, Des? Yeah, really, John. Right. Hot six kitten in Bangkok, English dub, scene seven, take one. <laughs> oh, Carlos, I can't stand this tropical heat any longer. I know I'm going to take this one. Let me do it for you, my darling. <laughs> oh, Carlos. Oh. 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 